or somebody who we play with, and he's rather new to the game. I'd say you guys have equivocal experience to the game. We, we all have our streams active, so you can actually tile open, open everyone's stream, so you can see their perspectives at all times. And when we would die, we would all funnel in on the person that's alive and watch what was still happening with our squad. And his mouse, we, we thought we were watching a, a glitch. His mouse, he's so nervous. He is so shook, just ambiently nervous, like sweating bullets that his character looks like it's in an earthquake and and that's his mouse hand his hands are shaking so bad that his that he's just an earth constant earthquake like it's a just a nerve-wracking game it puts you in a position fight or flight that is unlike anything else in any other game that that shaking of the hand to me is a core like neuro response to fear and stress and you, when you can't control it that's an intense you know that's like panic attack level stuff that that level of stress is very common and very present for a lot of people you should just be trying to remind yourself that it's not so much what you could have done differently because even if that person was a hacker there's not anything you could do differently you can't control it and you, and you can't weigh that on yourself you, you can't there are some scenarios where if you make a clearly wrong move yeah you chalk it up i fucked up i got myself killed but that's less of a that should be less of a rage and more of a learning experience because over time when you gather that knowledge rather than like run from it or fear it you you're just better you'll learn oh man last time i ran out here i got fucking popped like i got murdered so you'll you'll think twice you'll maybe look somewhere maybe you'll see that somebody's there or gonna kill you or you'll see two dead bodies already and be like oh try and not make it in the perspective of i fucked this up and keep it in the perspective of it's one of like the hardest first person shooter games ever created and there is no favors given out you have this to... is something that's meant to happen as part yeah, of the exactly. experience and even more importantly you're not the only person that actively still toe dips if you will there are a lot of people that do that and in my opinion those people they stay bad enough at the game that they don't think that they can ever be good at the game you might spawn in on reserve right by heating pipe and Gluhar and his boys might be standing on the back of K5 porch and the moment you spawn in you hear Renata and you know you all die sometimes that happens the only thing you could do is say hey thanks Nikita 